All right, in that last video, we learned to not change lenses while you're going through sand dunes because it's windy and the sand gets in your camera and your lenses and it's just a nightmare. So, unless you have four cameras, you know, with the lenses attached to them, but if you could only more realistic, realistically just take one camera and one lens attached to that camera and you never take that lens off that camera, which is more lightweight anyway, what lens would that be? Well, this is the lens that I think for me, is great for this situation. When you're walking around a beautiful uh, national park like this, uh, it's small, it's lightweight, so you don't get real like worn out trying to carry this thing. And it's a, uh, it's basically, it, it's a zoom. It's a 28 to 60, which is better than a 28 to 70. That's a, that's, I think a lower quality lens. This is, this is the kit lens that comes with the A7C. Do not take this uh, lightly. This is a, a, a really, really good lens. It's really sharp, it's really good, and it's a 28 to 60, so you've got a wide angle, which is great, and it goes to a 60, which is portrait, you know, for portraits and stuff like that. So since we're in nature, we want wide angle, and we want some portrait stuff. So I'm gonna take some pictures, you're gonna come along with me, using nothing but this little 28 to 60 kit lens that Sony came out with recently. Um, and I think we can take some good pictures with it. So, and it's great for traveling light. You don't have to carry all these lenses. So let's do it. Let's just use one lens. For lighting, I took two Godox AD 200s as my lights because two of them are much lighter than one AD 600 and they still give me enough light. I couldn't use any soft boxes because it was way too windy and the AD 200s are too weak for a soft box anyway in the bright sun. At full power with just the bare reflector, they do put out enough light though to fill in the shadows. Here's what it normally looks like without a light and this is what it looks like with. Again, this is without a light and this is with. The AD 200s are small, lightweight, and portable, and they provide quite a bit of light. But this video isn't about lights, it's about the kit lens. It's super lightweight, and it's great for these kind of shots where you want to show off the landscape while doing portraits. It's nice and sharp, great autofocus, and you still get a bit of background blur, just enough to add some separation from the foreground. It's a great all-purpose lens for portraits. As always, when I'm outside, I use a polarizing filter to add some contrast to the sky. Some of these shots look like 3D postcards shot in a studio. I love this look. That little bit of extra light gives it a surreal look, which I love. And of course, Kara is a great model. It's not hard to get great shots with her around. And magic hour. Well, actually, it's more like magic half hour. <laughs> Those last 20 minutes before the sun disappears behind the mountains. Great portrait lens. And an all-purpose everything lens. So you can get a magical look from a kit lens. All right, so there's our pictures for today. I think we did pretty good. We had a bunch of really good choices and some different variations of wide and, and more portrait type layouts. And I think this lens is great. I'm happy with it. Uh, it's not expensive. It costs under $500. It's small, look how small this thing is, lightweight. 
doesn't weigh much. So if you could only use one lens, I see why they gave this as the kit lens that comes with the a7C. I'm using it with an a7S III, which is an amazing camera using a kit lens from the a7C. You can buy these on their own. So there you go. I hope this uh, showed you some more alternative ways of thinking, possibilities and stuff like that. You don't need a bunch of lenses to take great pictures. Just one, that's it. Actually, I made a video where you don't even, I took pictures without a lens. <laughs> so just, just have fun. All right, I'll see you in the next video. Until then, have a great week with photography. Enjoy yourself. Wow.